James Harden is 12th year in the NBA. It will be Embiid and DeAndre Jordan, 13 years in the NBA, and we are running tonight. Seth Curry, who sat the second half Thursday night against Portland because of illness. Got to stop that guy, James Harden, all the way to the cup for two. Landry Shamit these days coming off the bench for the Nets. Simmons swoop into the hoop and scoring compliments of Tobias Harris. Oh, nice splitting of the defense. Did quick release. Almost feels like Jeff Green's played for every NBA team but the Sixers. He's been around for a while. Yep. That was Luawa Cabarro missing badly. Not a bad three-point shooter, though, at 37%. Tobias, Tobias Harris at the other end. First shot he has taken. Absorbing a little bit of that contact and then able to be strong enough to elevate even off of one leg for Tobias. Oh, my goodness. Well, DeAndre Jordan has made a handsome living getting a lot of dunks from feeds like that. A lob City, right? It was just yeah. out of control. Harden looking for the call. Curry, boy, in and out. Slam back by Tobias Harris, but poor Seth Curry sprained his right index finger in the same game. A loss last night at home to Toronto. There's a steal by Simmons, and he'll solo. A couple of giant steps at the end for Ben Simmons. Sixers against the Trailblazers missed their first 12 from beyond the arc. There's Embiid for a three, and he got it. Joel hits the three. He is shooting a career-high 42% from beyond the arc. Reaching a career-high just over 15. Ooh. Embiid. Don't touch it. Was it tipped in? Oh, the officials say no. The Nets are claiming that Green hit it. He got you on your shoulder. He could control you there. Harden the same way. Mm, Terry Porter. In the meantime, Embiid, good job here on Harden. Rather healthy three, of course. He's got good range. Too Quickly easy. against Jordan, but he can't get it off. Thought he had that angle to the basket, decided to give it up. No matter. Bad dude. Slow at triple doubles in his 12 year career. Rebounds, of course, his ability to pass. DeAndre Jordan, he needs it. Five feet or in, and he connects with a second bucket. T. Steibel now assigned to Harden. Posting Harris on Luau Cabarro. Can't get it to him. Torquemaz, a rolling Howard who threw it down with ferocity. Johnson unsuccessful. The seventh year from Fresno State, remember? Had some good years with Miami. Milton missing oh, nice. the three. Tobias Harris once again another offensive rebound. He's got five and all, and now he's got eight points. Harris an opportunity here against the smaller Landry Shamit. Got it over Pell and in. Ten now in the first half for Tobias Harris. Talked about who's going to do the scoring. Tobias right now volunteering. Shamit will try it again and finally drills one. Landry Shamit. Two or three before you adjust your defensive approach on Shamit. Still worry about him as a driver. Milton all the way to the cup for two. Shake third on the Sixers in scoring. You mentioned birthdays. You know it's Bob Marley's birthday today. He would have been 76 years oh, old. Wow. Good one. Bruce Brown not known as a three-point shooter and suffered that hyperextended right knee. Left the floor for a short time against Portland. Wawa Cabarro is second bucket, getting all the way to the hoop. Hung in there with it. We talked about how quick he's off the floor. He was first to that loose ball and able to put it back. And Simmons clearly taking advantage of a 6-4 Bruce Brown. Joel Embiid is back. Tough one. Yep, but he got it done anyway. Shake Milton getting the bucket his second of the game. Sixers average 16 turnovers. That's 28th of 30 NBA teams. Ah, Back door open. So good at that. And Joe Harris able to cash in. So the question is, what do you do? What do you do? Boy, MP getting the roll. He's got 17. Sixers could tie. Go ahead with a three. Final minute of the second. Curry, it's for three, and down it goes for Seth Curry. Ending a stretch of eight plus quarters without a point from anywhere on the floor. All the action of the Sixers Nets game from Wells Fargo Center. Second of back to back games for the Nets, but they still have James Harden, even though they don't have Kevin Durant.
I jinxed this. We're going to spend the rest of the night at the free throw line. <laughs> we'll be here till 11 o'clock. Exactly. Joel Embiid, he had 15 in the first quarter, two in the second. Curry two for two from beyond as Danny Green took a tumble. Embiid going to take over here against Harden. Should be fun. Harden stays back for a three and down it goes. What, as a purist just sitting back Still and maybe I'm not a purist wanting them to continue to play, yep. but I do, whether yep. it's the Sixers or the Nets. Agreed. He waved him. Signed as a free agent by Brooklyn, and now look what he's done. Yep. Putting all its chips on the fact that they're going to outscore people all the way to an NBA championship. Let's see whether or not they can make that happen. Harden. Harris comes up with a swipe. He's got Simmons, and Ben lays in two compliments of Tobias Harris. Instead, Landry flares right to that corner, knocks down the three. His third three. All nine of his points from beyond. Tobias Harris working hard for the money. You can count it. And a foul. Green. No. <laughs> oh, he was hoping for the contact. He had the look and then delayed it, looking for the contact. Whistle silent, and on the other end, it's Harden it alone, getting two Danny. of his 23. He does from that distance. Simmons fielding the air ball in the open floor. Now Green, it's for three, and down it goes for Danny Green. That's more like it. Sixers again matching their largest lead at 14. Harden just doing his thing. And B trying to get Pell to bite. 30 points for Joel and B. Simmons going for the swipe, and in fact, he got it. Ben, ooh, slamming ooh. for two off the break. Take that, Tyler Taunting. Johnson. Taunting. Last month, Milton looking to bust a move on Shamit. Got it over Pell and had his way. I think Andre Miller, who has never missed, yeah. and he got anywhere on the there floor you go. he wanted. Exactly, great example. 16, the margin for the Sixers. You say Miller, and I think of Rick Majerus. Mm. All the time. Mm. Big man with the sweaters. Yeah. Michael Doliak. Wow, with Cabarrow. Shit down. You have to dunk it. You can't lay anything up. Was his third block of the game as the Sixers smother Shamit. Bruce Brown going for the steal. That was for three for Shake Milton. Acknowledging a good decision by Shake on that end. Sixers back up 18. Shamit staying outside. He's feeling Tobias it. Harris, yeah. Averaging 38 and a half. He's averaging over 40 since the trade to Brooklyn. Yeah, it's good to see Landy Shamit getting his tonight. This unit's job is to keep it within striking distance until the big guns come back nice back door. And Harris able to grab it and slam for two. My rookie year, we were playing in Port in New Jersey. The only time we get to play back home, and we were up by 30 at the end of the third quarter, and I swore I was going in. Former head coaches as assistants, including Mike D'Antoni, with a wealth of head coaching experience, and Jacques Vaughn. Back door's open for Shamit. Slam shut by the Sixer defense at the rim. It's pretty good defense, the whole exchange there from Curry. I'm not a mad at that. Korkmaz for three, and down it goes for Furkan Korkmaz, his second three of the game, and he becomes the seventh. Sixer in double figures now with 10. Good. And the final score tonight, the Sixers 124.